Hey, I'm in higher, chapter 7 in polynomials, mixed exercise 7k at the end, number 12, a former higher question. There's a graph of a cubic function, it tells you here, and it says y equals negative 16 as a tangent, and it shows the x-coordinate of the point where that tangent hits the curve. In other words, it's telling you that a point on the curve here is 4, negative 16. What's the equation of the curve? Well, that's just reconstruct this cubic function from its zeros. Got the zeros of the graph there. Well, there's a root at zero. In fact, since it's a tangent point at zero, there's a double root there. That means there's two factors. Now you could either write x minus zero, x minus zero. Well, I've just started so well. Well, you could just write x times x. And the other one's going to be at x minus six. There may have been some common factor that was cancelled out of it. I'll find that from some other independent point. And there it is, four, negative 16. Pop that in. Negative 16 is k times, and if x is 4, it's going to be times 4, times 4, and then 4 minus 2. Well, I'll put it in. 4 minus 6, I mean, which is negative 2. So negative 16 is going to be, that's negative 2 times that. So that's k times negative 32, which means k is going to be, divided by that, k is going to be a half. So the function is y equals a half of x times x times x minus 6. So I've got a half x cubed minus a half of 6 is 3, just x squared. And that's about it. Done.